Hello and welcome back for episode 26 of my Escape from Tarkov Hardcore series. Uh, we had an interesting experience last game. Um, we got some nice gear. We have a level 5 rig, nice level 4 helmet with a face shield, and uh, we got a blueberry bag. This is the <laughs> biggest bag we've had to date. <laughs> um, so yeah, I kind of kitted out like a bit of a bit of a geared boy and I think I might just head into interchange and fill myself up um, problem being that we are having some space issues take a look at the hideout and see if we're getting any closer to some of our goals to get that second skeb box okay so we have our second mag box but we are in need of um, another fuel tank and some bolts to get um, this third mag case for the second junk box, which would be a big help. We'll just bring this ammo here. We'll do a little stash management afterward. I kind of just want to get into it. Um, take a look at this gun. A couple changes I could make. I don't think I'm a huge fan of the canted sight. I think I really like it mounted further back because you can make some of the longer shots a little bit easier. Uh, but apparently it's kind of, if you're using this angled sight, Apparently your arms will get in the way and save your ass quite a bit, um, but I think we're just going to go old-fashioned old on this one. Drop the front and rear off. And then take this off. And then just put that on where it's supposed to be. And I think that's what we're going to call good for now. Um, the other thing we could do is if we wanted to suppress it, I think we can switch these two. Uh, sorry for the delay here. I just want to make sure I'm doing this correctly. Yeah, let's switch these two. Still pretty good for um, our recoil stats. We've got our car, first aid, our painkillers. I think we're going to bring a cheese out for good measure. I wish I had a... Oh, I do. So let's bring out a propotol as well. Um, all right, let's hop into interchange. Get some looting done, and if we find any bad guys, uh, we can actually do something about it this time. Okay, we actually have a good spawn to get inside, so we're going to do that. Okay, our light is on. Scabs can spawn already, and they usually will come down that ramp, and so they have. Ow, oh, dude, are you fucking joking me? Can't see dick. Fucking kidding me, dude. Hit him eight times in the chest and still gets a shot off. Yeah, we're just gonna have a broken arm for the rest of the match, so... I guess I'll take this for the pain. Try to make it a quick round. Leave me the fuck alone. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, stop yelling. It's fucking scabs, man. We'll grab the PST GZH. No, 
know if I'm hearing something. I think it's above me. I think we're gonna sprint up the stairs here. No. I don't really understand. He zorped like made zero noise that was really um i guess unexpected is the right word for that but it was unbelievable maybe is a better word for that um i don't know i've had some really shitty tarkov things happen uh the last few days of playing so that was pretty frustrating i mean i don't think he was cheating i think it was probably just like horrible desync um, I am going to fix the fracture. So I think that is stupid. Well, there goes that gun. And there goes that bag. There goes that rig. And there goes that helmet. Oh, uh, and so it goes. We roll on into another. Making space. I guess. Ugh, losing that much ammo just hurts. I'm just going to spend it at Mechanic to get some cash on Mechanic. I probably should have done it for, um, let's see, do I have any of these that I can wear? Um, hmm, hmm, we'll grab that. Grab a nade. We'll wait to full heal until um, we're ready to go out. We're bringing this in. We might as well grab one of our headsets. We'll bring our favorite pair here. Um, I don't think we really need the helmet, but I think it's worth bringing. Um, and I think I will bring this big puppy out. I don't really want to. Probably bring the black rock first. Try to throw some attachments in there. And out here. Okay, got another nade. Yeah, we can bring both, it's fine. Take a look at this ammo. A little 855, got a little 856A1. Bring about 15. To top off the mags here. Deal with these low salewas. We can create some space. Um, what do we have to bring in here? We have an IFAC, but it's so so nice and space saving. I think I'd rather not use it. We can bring this out and a cheese. Should be enough. All right. Yeah, that was um, painful. <laughs> Get this nice kit. Lose it instantly to fly around the corner desync. Oh well. Okay. Least favorite spawn again. Which, uh, you guys know the deal. Also, we're running low on the 5.56 ammo. We have two other 5.56 guns that we'd like to use. Two, maybe three. Um, so getting a little bit more. Like, we've got 15, 20 more rounds of, like, usable bullets. 
Just not enough. Okay. See anybody stash running at least for that little check? All right, let's see what Papa Christmas has for us. Yeah. Nothing exciting there. stash I'm at the point where I'm going to stop taking things that I like really know I'm not going to barter especially if it's common and I can farm it later okay look here and there I'm wondering if I'll see somebody in the Scab Town. Fairly sure I don't need nails. That death was... Pretty disappointing. <laughs> what do we got down here? Okay. Filter absorber? Alright, we'll grab it for now. I think I can s vendor it for a decent amount. Not sure if it's needed for any quests. Also, didn't know you could get it out of these stashes. Kind of cool to know. Juice. Splints for all of my various broken app appendages. Check up there. Check over here. Check over there. Try to diligently scan. Adjust my mouse cord. Should be better. As much as I'd love for somebody to peek that, even if I killed them up there, I'd be scared to go loot it. <laughs> A little bit of quiet time for old hardcore here. Another splint, we're pretty much rich.
Her eyes open. And a quiet map. Spooky quiet. Okay. Guess we can check it. We'll search XP at least. It doesn't start open. Interesting. Wonder if somebody started it in scav camp. And it's curling along the right side. If this is open, then yeah. It isn't. Could have taken the wide way. Just skip this. Okay. Okay. Feel pretty good about finding some good ammo, even if it's not for my current weapon. I don't think I ever really checked back here, but maybe I'll do it just for curious as to whether this will be looted. My assumption would be yes. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, can I please get this so I can please finish this quest? Scared. I think I have enough of this ammo type. It's just kind of burning a hole for space at the moment. Getting some strength experience. Look behind me real quick. Okay, no movement there. Ahead of me, so I don't get headshot there again. Generally speaking, it's really safe over here, but that is generally speaking. Just a rock, John. Just a rock. Bolts, okay. Up, up the scope. All right. We drink, and we take. I like it, a juice. Should probably drop one thing. That, I guess. You lost the propital too, which I know is like silly, but like, uh, it just sucks to die with a good kit, like, without even being able to, like, have a fight.
Bit of a bummer. BT, okay. Okay, I think I drop you and you. Unload you and you. I drop you and I grab you. Interesting. This one is looted out. Hmm. Let's see what was left. Shitty slugs. Mixer camera? I guess we take that. Kinda wanna leave a slot. Bandage, screws. I think we're gonna screws for now. Probably will regret that. If I need it for something that I don't know. Check this one as well. Interesting that they would leave a Nixer. So good. I think I can make it all the way there. in. Okay. Not exciting, but it's effective. We'll see what that uh, air filter vendor's for. Definitely not worth my stash space to keep it on hand. She's hit level 15, which I think does something for some of our traders. It opens up a ragman quest for the mall. Which we can do at some point soon. We also got the um, the gas analyzer for our friend therapist for a little XP. So that's really nice. Waiting forever for that. Sweets. Guess we just need more. Pick this one up. Nobody has hit level two. He would if we have the amount sold to him, so that's nice to know. He would. If we have the amount sold to him, which is nice to know. Same. And then Ragboy, I need 750. Okay. So. BT. I guess we overflow just here for now. Unless we can stack on 7 and 39. Nope. Oh. Cannot. Those two out there, we can do some bartering real quick. Just for a little space saving. Blop, blop, blopa, blopa. Guess they're just gonna chill there. We do another. Guess we do another. Okay. Thought I moved that one. All right. 
good for now. Let's see who we can trade this to. Rapper, he does buy it. Therapist buys it as well. No way he buys it, right? What does Peacekeeper buy it for? Nothing. All right, this looks like a proper sale. Oof, I feel like I need this for something. Um, and I should hold on to it for now. Can't remember, I'll have to look into that. Relays, toilet paper. Shaka for trading for an AKM. Meds, 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 meds. Grenade stuff. Nuts and bolts and stuff. Rip ammo. Oy vey. Overloading my brain. Another pistol. <laughs> For another sad time some sometime later down the line. So we need Tazes. We need kills on customs. We just need um, sales to most of these guys. Some meds, some cash. You can use this for some out of raid heal. Switch it over for something a little bit nicer. Take a look at our hideout, grab that other mag box. No, I think we still need a fuel, right? Can we take one out of here? Yeah, we can take this one out. And so we can grab this, and then we can start our next craft, which should be our third mag box. This mag box should have landed somewhere right here. Okay, throw it there for now. We'll have to take all this out. I'll definitely, you know, I was thinking about getting to the fourth mag box before I craft the scab box, but I'll have to figure out whether the space saving is worth it. Maybe I can do a little math on that, but chainlet um, can be sold, but I think it might to traders. Revisor, the tech tech at level four, the tech tech at level two. Um, Hmm. Tough sell on keeping that. We can look at it later. Let's uh get back into interchange because we need all the same standard barter stuff. Okay, we've got this one again. Probably against medical advice, but want to go inside again. And just get upstairs faster. A really long time. Something's fucking messed up. Oh, there goes all my good ammo. Weird. Just won't think about it too hard. Bleed. Should just get upstairs.
I actually want to overwatch that fight going on over there. Okay, let's take a moment here. Quickly fill this mag up so we can switch back. And then we're going to go peek from above. It's risky, but could net some really good stuff. Sad to have used so much ammo. Okay, so we're expecting them over here. Entirely sure. Oh. Thought I saw something. Thought I saw something down there. Fuck. Don't break my legs. Well. Ouch, my legs. Probably stupid to feel my legs here, but I want to be able to sprint and not black them. I don't like being on this wood here either. Is his buddy on his body? I don't think so. Well, I'm super loud because my legs are broken. It's a bit obnoxious. He's probably camping the body. All right, let my hands get up. I'm hoping I'll get an audio cue on him as I approach and be able to flush him out with a grenade. That's the ideal.
painkiller. It's tough. I really want this loot. What do you guys think? Type F in the chat if you want me to fucking go balls deep. Should I yell that I have a broken leg? Be funny. Stop potatoing! God damn it! I'm hitting him, I'm hitting him, I'm hitting him. It's not enough. I think he hit me with a shotgun. Sounded like a shotgun. Oh, it sucks. Fucking traded. Hmm. Really sucks. Oh. The life of hardcore just goes through so much heartache on a daily basis. Mm. Mm. That was a fun fight. I just kept missing the shots. For this AK-103. Couple of guns that are just taking up space that are kind of like my backup guns. Got this SA58. Quite nice. Let's bring this puppy in. Okay. Could bring in a nice rig. Shouldn't bring this gun in without a good rig. So I'm going to bring in one of the TV rigs or the M1 rig. And I kind of don't want to bring those rigs in. So I'm feeling like a armorless run. Something a little more budgety. Could bring this pistol in with this. It's a 7 and 31. We'll do a lot of nice work. We can go inside kind of the same way. We can take an IFAC. A painkiller. Create some stash space here. Yes, yeah, so we traded on that last shot. None of those things happen. I don't have any trash armor, do I? No, I don't. The other possible option would be to do some rig runs. Right, bringing this TV rig with this gun. And then I can get out at the hole in the wall. But, like, I haven't really been having trouble extracting. So, I don't think that's my big priority. Let's do this. All right. And we'll try again. Okay. We're about 40 seconds late. But I'm thinking we still rush inside. Hmm. Let's hit this stash first. Let's see what we get here. Juice, fuse, juice. I mean, I like it a juice. Oh shit. Scav? I think a scav.
What a weird fucking optic on this thing. Got a PM pistol. TT pistol. Got a nice rig though. Check his pockets. I think, I think we might head for power station actually. So we'll switch out to our full ammo mag. Quickly take a look in there. Okay. Nothing exciting. Drink the second juice because why not? If I wanted to trade bag for rig, I could right now. I just drop my bag and then go through the hole in the wall. Not like a horrible idea. I mean, I would get a run through, but do I really care? I don't think I do really care. No. Maybe if I get good loot at power station. Hmm, thought I was hearing somebody up there. Could be. I'm hoping um, whoever spawned at power station just turned the power on and left. It took me a long time to be able to line up a good shot on that guy who prone, so I don't have high hopes for this gun against players unless I really have the drop on him. Okay, let's just... Use the laser then. Now, up above, pretty much for sure. Okay. Anything else I want to heal up? Probably thorax and head. Could wait for him to make a move. It's kind of sketchy. Juice. Super bad for me. What are my options? I don't really have any. Be up above there. That just wouldn't make sense for where I got shot. I think he was up that way. Okay. He's up there. Three. We'll hop, skip, and jump. I think he's up in the container.
mean, I could just loot this out, kill some time. See if he wants to push me, like... Yeah, why the fuck not? Alright. Hmm. Tough spot here. Check the toolboxes, but it looks like this has all been hit. Guessing that's the guy that hit this up. Hit it up and just start camping it. Hmm. This gun is so inaccurate at range that, like... It's not even a reasonable option to try to take shots. I'd have to get... Shit. Multiple. I wonder if up above guy's gonna shoot at these guys. We can try for it. It's just a pistol. They might be trying for car exit. Yep. Fuck. Must not append or bounced. I don't have nades, do I? I think it's for a car exit for sure. Maybe one's on that side? I'm broken arm. Hmm. Should be at about the minute point here. How about you stop walking when I press caps lock? Oh, it's frustrating. I don't think any of my shots connected. I wonder if that scope hits high. We'll find out. Four hits, yeah. So one, I think, was absorbed into the helmet. I think that was a level four helmet with a face mask. Ah, eh, well. Double bleeds. See you later. A uh, couple heartbreakers, honestly. <sighs> Okay. Well, I think that about does it for episode 26. If you are watching, thanks for tuning in. Uh, if you have any comments on how to improve things uh, or, or any particular raids you'd like to see me do, any setups you'd like me to, to see me try, let me know. Um, but if you've stuck in there, I appreciate it. And I'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye.